So Germany has extremely efficient recycling centers and what they do is they collect all of the organic matter that people have or the compost that people use and toss away and they bring it to these large centers where they break it down and let it uh, decompose and heat up and all that good stuff. And then eventually, after a year or so, maybe a little longer, it's available to the public in forms of compost or normal soil, really awesome good soil that you can take home and put into your raised beds or your normal gardens or as topsoil. So over here we have some topsoil and over here we have something we like to call compost here which is actually just a finished compost, um, not really a compost in the sense of anything that's uh, um, uh, still breaking down. So today we're here to put some in the back of this lovely trailer and take it on and, and uh, this lovely ladies about to use the big truck and stick it on and we're gonna film that and then we're gonna take it to the um, to the allotment so let's watch Like it's too hot. Yep, yeah, compost as it breaks down, it actually heats up. This is heating up uh, for two reasons. One, it's probably still breaking down at some very small level, but also because the sun, of course, is heating it up and it's black. So it's nice and hot on, uh, inside. So it looked like a ton of dirt, and it actually is. It's about one cubic meter or half a ton or so. Um, but when you have it in there and look, it doesn't look that big. So we're gonna take it to the allotment and we're going to shovel it out and it'll be about 17 or so um, wheelbarrows and then we'll come back and we'll do that four more times, possibly five if we have the energy. Load number two.
been a pretty exciting two weeks. We uh, pulled all the weeds out, uh, rototilled it. There weren't any worms in there to worry about. Uh, we put down uh, horse manure. It was well rutted horse manure. Then we put down three tons of finished compost. And now I'm putting the strawberries back in, the ones that we actually found originally here amongst all the weeds two weeks ago. Uh, and we rescued, it took us two days to rescue all these strawberries. Um, and now we're putting them back in and I'm watering them. So hopefully they'll be happy. Like I said, it's been a long two weeks and I am ready for a hot bath and a cup of tea. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next episode and stay tuned because there will be a lot more to come for this little allotment. Toodaloo.